So it's an autonomous data machine. So what it does is, um, our, the goal of the company is try to predict and prevent crime. And so we do this by taking existing data from like historical data and also um, on the on-site data and as well as the, the social media. Uh, so for example, we get something off Twitter and historical data as in historical data as in like if an area is um, is a little danger is dangerous as well as taking like the video um, live, mm -hmm. we'd be able to see uh, like likely likelihood of um, crime happening. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So. How many cameras you have around? Uh, right now there are four. So there's this one big one in front, and these sides um, have cameras as well. Uh, we might have removed them for this demo, but uh, for right now we have one, like, one big one. And what is this? So this one's an optical character recognition. So it's like it's a license plate recognition. This one? Yeah, the license. This one right here. Oh, okay. It's a. It recognizes license plate, so you know if you like throw your license plate across, it will pick it up. And so this will allow us to uh, compare the license plate uh, with, like, with the database. And so we know someone like has stolen cars in the area, or if um, maybe a sexual offender is coming by, we would know. What do you have? Oh, that right there is a LiDAR. So it's basically a, um, a, like a laser distance finder. So it shoots out a, um, so it shoots out a laser and it uh, bounces back at it. And so, there's, uh, so it records like uh, a 270 degree. Of, uh, and measures out how far things are away from it. And so what we do with it is that we make it move. Its, so it's uh, rotating? It's, a, it, it's rotating? It's rotating. Oh, really? That's amazing. Yeah. So it's rotating uh, around? Yeah, so this laser gets to spit, go, go from the front and back. So it makes it 270, uh, 270 like this. Oh, uh, okay. It's back and forth. And so what we also do is that we move the head back and forth like this. And so with that, we'd be able to get a 3D map of the room. So you have a slim edge. Yes. And so mm -hmm. with that, we'd be able to detect, um, you know, how far something is, if we would hit something, and you know, things like that. Mm -hmm. So this is just for nice? Uh, so what, I mean, this guy is actually dimmed down quite a lot. If we wanted to turn it up, we could. It, would, it, would, it serves as a purpose to light its way in, um, at night. So what is this? Uh, I don't push it. Don't push it. It's a. Um, Just turn on off. For right now, since this is a, a beta prototype, uh, we uh, this button is for um, it's emergency sh shut off. Mm -hmm. It's emergency shut off. I see. So I'm developing right now. It's autonomy, um, autonomy, uh, autonomous. Uh, software and so you know I, I, it would be nice to have an emergency button just for working on that so where do you think it's supposed to go around inside the parking lot or where? yeah i mean um eventually in the future we want this to be able to um skip, uh, deploy anywhere like inside a mall inside a parking lot warehouses and streets everywhere so we hope this guy can be um in the streets and uh, you know integrated with like human like society so. So, um, so, so, like, what is it you, right? You are one of the that's not uh, well, uh, okay, let it put it that way. Uh, first of all, question. Uh, what this device is for? It's to predict and prevent crime. Uh -huh, yes, and so then I get it it's, it's also kind of making the pictures kind of like a security card. But mm -hmm. not, not like a, it doesn't kind of scale to a person, of course. You can't, have, you can't match up any of those But what it does is it, get, it has a halo of sensors, and with these sensors, it can uh, just, you know, know the particles in there. What about smell detection? Yeah, I mean, uh, we have uh, air quality sensor, uh, uh, air sensor, uh, air particle sensor, mm -hmm. and so we'd be able to pick up the uh, oh, yeah. oh. <laughs> Can you smell marijuana? <laughs>